Hello, I am Belief, and I want to talk to you today about the importance of perception on safety. Remember our last Health and Safety Week? We have learned that we should intervene at work like we would in our families if we see unsafe situations or behaviors. What can we as humans do to keep focused and avoid accidents? Actually, a lot. Our brain gets most information through our eyes. However, our way of perceiving our environment is far from perfect. There are four limitations that we need to deal with to avoid accidents. Limitation number one. We do not perceive any dangers that are out of our field of view. Limitation number two. We always look at the same places while working. This routine makes us blind to some dangers and we're missing a lot of information for our safety. Limitation number three. Our brain unconsciously selects information that is interesting for us. Only if we are interested in dangers will we perceive them. Limitation number four. Our brain unconsciously fills the gaps with our imagination or memories. This can cause us to overlook some dangers. So, what can we do to improve our perception of dangers? First, you can make sure to fully use your field of view while you're walking, working or driving. Changing habits is also a great way to improve your perception. Try, for example, to find another way to get to work. You will see many new things. Then, you can take 30 seconds to scan the environment for dangers at the start of a new task. If you see something about to happen, please stop the job and talk to your colleagues and manager. Also, you can discuss about what you see. Four eyes are always better than two. Talking about it will train your brain to perceive dangers faster in the future. You become a safety hero. You can share your experience with your colleagues. Help them become a safety hero too. And now, the final test to see if you have really been paying attention. During my presentation, there were some changes in the classroom. You have 10 seconds to highlight the changes you have spot. Let's see the results. This is the classroom as it was in the beginning of this animation. And this is how it is now. There were seven changes in total. As you can see, it's very easy to miss something. Remember the three things you can do. One, fully use your field of view and change your routines from time to time. Two, take 30 seconds to scan your environment before a new task. Three, discuss what you see and learn from each other. Do it at home and do it exactly the same way at work.